Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Illustrator 2022 tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to use the new 3D and materials panel right here to create big brass balls. Mm -hmm. That's right guys, we're going to do some Giga Chad brass balls here. So I'm going to show you how to do this. Uh, so let's go ahead and neglect and delete these balls. And... Uh, Let's go ahead and start creating our own from scratch. So, I've got this really ugly lopsided person here, stick man, and I want to create some brass balls. The first step I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the left side here, going to grab that ellipse tool, and I'm just going to go ahead and draw out a perfect circle. This looks like a good size for a ball, so we're going to have a nice cool looking purple ball to start. I'm going to go ahead and hold down the Alt key if you're on a PC, Option key if you're on a Mac. And I'm going to drag the side, so we're going to have two balls. All right, cool. The first step is I'm going to go ahead and left click on the on the left ball, and um, I'm going to I'm going to open up the uh, 3D and materials panel or window. Now, when you do that, you have a bunch of different options. But what we want to do is we want to inflate the balls. All right, cool. You see what we did there? We've got some inflation on that left ball. Now, we want to go to materials. So I've taken the object. We're in 3D materials. We've inflated the ball. Now we're going to go ahead and switch down to materials. And when you do that, you're going to see a whole bunch of different options for the balls. Now, when we go down to the bottom here, I mean, if I look at this die cast brass, this is a pretty sweet looking uh, ball. So I'm going to go ahead and left click on die cast brass and presto we've gone ahead now and created a nice looking brass ball. Now you can of course go in here and make some adjustments if you want. If you want to see what a gold set of balls like gold finger uh, might look like you can left click on gold leaf ball or gold natural for that matter and you've got another cool looking ball or even copper foil actually this looks really cool too. And this does have a sort of brassy look too. So I'm just going to show you a few different options for the balls. Uh, let's go ahead and right click on this one. And I'm going to make this one a die cast brass ball. So we've got a brass ball and a copper ball. So that we're working and taking a look here. Let's work on the, the copper ball. I'm going to go now and switch up to lighting. And I won't go and bore you with the details. But you can make a whole bunch of changes. Like the intensity of the lighting. The rotation of the lighting. Depending on where you want your light source. Uh, the softness of the lighting, the ball, and stuff like that, and even things like intensity. So I'm going to go ahead and dial down the intensity. And again, these are all different options that you can work with. We can also change the color. So if you want to go to a, like a bit of a darker color for the light, for example, maybe we'll go with something like that and hit OK. We've got a darker colored ball. But this is how you go ahead and make some really cool adjustments, and you can start making that brass ball look. Let's go ahead and add in some variation here. You can add in some irregularities. So you're, you're, you're getting the, the point here. But the main thing is, yeah, aging. Let's get some old grandfather balls. Um, and I mean that like as in a grandfather yeah. clock. Uh, but yes, there are an amazing amount of material properties and things that you can do. But, but just going into this 3D and materials and adjusting the different um, materials here, like troweled. What would a troweled ball look like? <laughs> Um, I don't even want to guess, but uh, yeah, okay, let's trowel the ball. So again, guys, this is how you go ahead and make brass balls and a variety of other balls inside Adobe Illustrator using 3D and materials. That's all for this tutorial. Thanks for watching. Be back soon.